Hello and welcome to another lesson brought to you by LearnDrumsLive.com. In today's lesson, I thought it'd be interesting to look at some of the things I've been working on and some of the specific um, styles or grooves I've been practicing and trying to learn more about. Uh, one of the books that I've been using quite a bit over the last couple of weeks, I've owned for a while, but I've kind of recently reintro reintroduced myself to it, is this book um, by Royal Hardigan. Okay, and it looks at applying uh, traditional West African rhythms, put it up there again, to the drum set. So I thought it'd be interesting to, to uh, play some examples out of the book today. It's a great book, um, really recommend it. Again, it is Royal Hardigan's uh, West African Rhythms for Drum Set, one of the better books I own, I feel. And anyway, um, what I thought would be a good idea is play you, um, like I said, a couple of examples out of the book. Start out with um, part of the groove, uh, which includes the right hand, right foot, and left foot. This is a particular rhythm um, from a tribe in Africa. And then, uh, so I'll play the what everything is going to be based off of, and then I'll go through some examples and show you different left hand patterns. So the main pattern, the, the thing you want to learn first is this. Okay, that's the main pattern. It's going to be played quicker, but that's what it is. Dot, 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 dot. And each one of these instruments on the drum set, of course, is interpreted um, as a, an African uh, percussion. Okay, um, these are not like kungas and bongos and things like that, but things that are made specifically by these tribes to play these rhythms. So remember, that's going to be the rhythm that we do all these examples on. The only thing that's going to change is the left hand pattern. All right, I hope you enjoy this and thanks for stopping by. <laughs> 